Dogma 95 was a radical cinematic movement created by a group of rebel Danish filmmakers. First established in 1995, Dogma established a set of rules known as the Vows of Chastity, which were an agreement for producing films using this style of filmmaking. The ten rules read, Shooting must be done on location. Props and sets must not be brought in. If a particular prop is necessary for the story, a location must be chosen where this prop is to be found. The sound must never be produced apart from the images or vice versa. Music must not be used unless it occurs where the scene is being shot. The camera must be handheld. Any movement or immobility attainable in the hand is permitted. The film must be in colour. Special lighting is not acceptable. If there is too little light for exposure, the scene must be cut or a single lamp be attached to the camera. Optical work and filters are forbidden. The film must not contain superficial action, meaning murders, weapons, etc. must not occur. Temporal and geographical alienation are forbidden. That is to say that the film takes place here and now. Genre movies are not acceptable. The film format must be Academy 35mm. The director must not be credited. These rules were signed by Danish filmmakers Lars von Trier, Christian Lebring, Thomas Vinterberg and Soren Krag Jakobsen. 500 copies were distributed while people were celebrating the 100th anniversary of filmmaking at a Parisian film event filled with industry professionals. Dogma 95 endorsed simpler and more naturalistic films and paved the way for Danish cinema to take the international spotlight in cinema in the 90s. These rules allowed for lower production costs, although this is not a requirement as long as the rules are followed, and got the names of these generally unknown filmmakers to become household names. Dogma 95 has been a massive influence on Danish culture, as the idea of bringing filmmaking back to its origins seem to inspire other artists to pursue the same through their own mediums. Anti-Hollywood in its very nature, Dogma was created as a response to contemporary cinema in the 90s, with the members of the Dogma movement wanting to reinvigorate the mediocrity of modern cinema. Von Trier even was quoted to say that Dogma 95 is a rescue action, and describes the last 10 to 20 years prior as rubbish. In the mid-90s, the signatories of the Dogma 95 Declaration vowed to make films that were free of pretension and all the indulgences of Hollywood filmmaking. This unique type of cinematic realism allowed for an emphasis on acting and character relationships. In total, 35 official Dogma films were made, however many have since taken influence from this movement. In 2005, with the emergence of affordable and intelligent digital video technologies, Dogma films started to look much cleaner. Von Trier decided that Dogma itself had by that point become a cliché. It then ended in 2005.